The demand for locally grown food in Central Texas continues to rise. That's a good thing for local farmers, but many are growing close to retirement. The average age of a Texas farmer is 59. Only 6% are under the age of 35. All new at 6, KXAN's Aaron Cargyle found out there are programs in the works right here in Central Texas to keep us fed for years to come. So anyway, we don't do this by hand. Skip Connett has gotten back to his family roots. Those are blues. They're not quite ready. His parents were farmers. Yeah, it looks like it's a good harvest. So five years ago, at age 50, he and his wife decided to move to Austin and start Green Gate Farms. Last year, they expanded their small organic vegetable farm in East Austin to this 33-acre farm in Bastrop County. I figured it would be good potato soil, and it is. Just as much wood as we need. A new barn is being built, and a new program is getting off the ground to help close the generational farming gap. Skip plans to designate two-acre plots for up-and-coming farmers like 26-year-old Travis Surf and his wife, who don't have a lot of money but want to start supplying produce for more restaurants and food trailers. It's easy to get like a job on a farm, but it's hard to get a farm. Travis also plans on applying for the latest round of state grants up for grabs only offered to young farmers between 18 and 45. He could get up to 10 grand for seed and fertilizer and tend his own crops full time. And if we had to work full time and farm full time, it's basically impossible. You know, we can't work in the city and drive 45 minutes out here and then farm at night. We would we would fall over dead in a year. I just started as a as a hobby. The extra cash was critical for Brenton Johnson when he bought this 40-acre farm in southeastern Travis County last year. If I had to tell you a list of everything we were growing that right now, we'd, we'd be here for a while. These are the best crops he's ever had, but the 38-year-old is really just getting started. In four years, the ag sure engineering really major has turned his backyard hobby into one of the largest local organic farms that feeds about a thousand. Brenton and Travis hoped to have some company a few years down the road. If people want to eat locally, there's going to be people to grow it. Aaron Cargyle, KXAN, Austin News.